on, Elvira? I hope everybody's having a blessed Thursday. Yeah, I look like a war. I just got done working out, and I put some banana on my face because my face wants... I always want my face to fit, um, soak in banana because it pulls out all the accidents and all the dirt and stuff, and it's great. And then I'll take a shower and relax for the rest of the night. But I thought we'd do a lima bean, fresh lima bean vegetable soup. Everything is fresh. We got some fresh mushrooms, potatoes, celery, carrots. Parsley, mint, two cloves of garlic, two avocados, an onion, some sweet peppers, and some fresh spinach. Now, I already boiled the lima beans because I don't use canned lima beans. I use the bag. So it takes about an hour. You have to boil. And you'll be seeing that I, throughout the show, I'm drinking my tea, which has got, uh, it's decaf, but it has ginger root in it. I have to drink that for the day yet. And I still have another fit team and stuff so and we have tons of seasonings too so let's start chopping away and i hope everybody's staying safe i hope everybody's staying healthy because that's what it's all about it's about being healthy about staying safe and all that good stuff i had to do my circuit today um my one trainer is they had a we had a school delay because where i'm at we had some really bad we had um some ice this morning and schools were shut down about an inch of snow and um it ended up that he couldn't come some other train so I was changing my circuit today I did 20 cows on the bike 30 seconds on the skier 25 pound med ball 10 slams um I did a barbell push to press 10 times and 30 jump ropes eh, jump roping well it's a little better but not a lot I mean, I did better, and then at the very end, I did 30, th 30 of them, but I got 29.53, uh, not too shabby. That was an easy circuit for me. Um, usually, I have harder ones, but since I had a bold muscle the last three weeks, and my one trainer, Andrew, has been working on my shoulder, and we're finally getting it, and I have a massage gun now that I use, and... helps my muscles and stuff we all have them it smells so good that garlic and I have fresh broth and then we'll fill it up with water, put our seasonings in. That's why I always have fresh broth because I don't, that's why I use so many seasonings because I don't use any store-bought broth. It's got too much sodium. Plus, we're going to make a great tuna salad to go with this, so... Hope everybody stay tuned, and of course we'll have calorie count. Alright, let me wash my hands because it slides with the onion and I don't want to cut my hands. I cut my hands so many times and stuff, I don't want to do that again. So, and with avocado, it will do that. Mm. It's got a good taste on that avocado. This is going to be my lunch. And usually I get the soup for like a couple of weeks, but that's fine. Because I just like to have the soup and... Um, you know, I like lunch and stuff. I just like to be able to just heat it up. With working out in my job, I just don't have a lot of time. So.
It's great if you're making soup because then you don't need two little ones to make a big one. And okay, and of course it's getting. Oh, that's this one here is a little more because when you're dealing with a lot of the. Uh, vegetables if they're slimy I, or not slimy but you know like really slippery and gooey I want to make sure my hands are really washed at each time because I don't want to uh, cut my hands and I've done that enough times mix this up a little bit spinach cooks down anyway so sometimes I don't even I just cut it like just a little bit just to get it in the pan and that's it because it cooks down to nothing and then I use three cups of spinach and it's always fresh spinach I get these bags like at, at the store for like $2.99 that's fresh spinach and you can't beat that too soon. Okay. Yeah, about me. It didn't really bother me today when I had to go out in this weather, but I have a truck, so I have a car that sits in the garage and a cover on it. I use that in the summertime. I just bought my new truck. So I was like, yes, get to use my truck this winter and get through everywhere I need to go. It's been great. Sometimes when I grab stuff, you get all the different vegetables. I just go ahead and chop them all together because you're going to chop them anyways.
like this one. Um, I don't know what the calorie count is. I've made it, but I will learn the calorie count together. Um, I just like the idea that it's a good, uh, it's a good soup. Um, especially in the winter time, you know, if you want something to warm you up, especially if it's really cold. This is a great soup. like the fresh vegetables um this time i'm not using any frozen sometimes i do but i don't need any frozen so i was like nah please use all fresh we have enough I think what really sets this soup off compared to my other ones is the seasoning. The seasonings are really good. We'll be breaking here pretty soon. And then we'll come back, finish chopping, put our seasonings in, and put it on the stove. this potato will break and then we'll come back cut our celery and our carrots add our seasonings and stick it on the stove and let it cook chop their other carrots up and then we will break and come back. almost everything chopped except our celery we're gonna break here and i will be back and we will add our seasonings cut our celery and get her on the stove god bless everybody and i'll see you in a few don't forget to hit the like and subscribe bye